22 February 1943, North Atlantic Ocean. James A. Hirschfield commands the Coast Guard Cutter Campbell as part of a convoy escort group when the convoy is attacked. German U-boats fire torpedoes that sink one ship and damage two others. During the ensuing battle, Hirschfield's cutter engages six U-boats, forcing them to submerge and damaging at least two. His crew then rescues 50 survivors from a torpedoed Norwegian tanker. As he rejoins the convoy, another U-boat surfaces up ahead. Hirschfield directs his crew to ram the enemy boat, which they do with a glancing blow. As the submarine slides past, his crew expeditiously drops two depth charges that fatally cripple the enemy. The two vessels are so close that Hirschfield is wounded by flying splinters from the explosion. Despite his injury, he remains in command throughout the action and subsequent period. Campbell sustains damage during the counterattack and is disabled by a flooded engine room. Hirschfield directs repairs as well as the rescue and capture of several prisoners from the U-boat crew. For his inspiring leadership and the valiant devotion to duty, Commander Hirschfield receives the Navy Cross, a Purple Heart, and later in his career receives the Distinguished Service Medal. He continues to serve a remarkable Coast Guard career, retiring as Vice Admiral.